Hello friends, my name is Eunice and welcome to my 10 step evening skincare routine. I don't do all of these 10 steps every night, but at least 6 of them are incorporated into my daily routine. After taking a warm shower and getting into my PJs, I started with my dental care. Dental care is also very important to me and every night I floss my teeth and use an electric toothbrush to brush my teeth. Now begins the skincare. I like to double cleanse almost every night, starting with the Muji Cleansing Oil. This is a great cleansing oil that removes makeup without needing any cotton pads. Even though I'm not wearing any makeup today, I had sunscreen on, so I still like to double cleanse. Next, I use the Crave Beauty Matcha Hydrating Cleanser, which is my absolute favorite cleanser. It's so jelly-like and hydrating, and it doesn't feel like it's stripping away all of my natural moisture and skin barrier. I have combination oily skin, but the oiliness is from being dehydrated, so most of my skincare products target hydration. That's my main focus, which may be the same or different to your skincare needs. I do have a towel that's just for my face and nothing else, which really helps with preventing breakouts because you don't want just any old towel to be touching your face. Then I exfoliate using the Skin Food Black Sugar Wash Off Mask Scrub. This is a new one, as you can see. I only exfoliate once every few weeks and I use a physical exfoliant rather than a chemical exfoliant. My skin doesn't react super well to chemical exfoliants, although my toner has some AHAs and PHAs. Today I applied the scrub on a dry face and left it on my skin for a few minutes before washing it off. Sometimes I scrub it on a slightly damp face and wash off immediately so that it's less abrasive. I love how soft it makes my skin feel. Next up, I use the Innisfree Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. I only do this once every few months and it really helps to brighten my skin and improve its texture. My skin has been breaking out a bit more lately from all the Christmas treats and this mask did a great job in helping curb the breakouts. It's so satisfying to apply clay masks on the face. Then I leave it on for 10 minutes and in the meantime I read When Striving Cease by Ruth Chow Simons. Here's some of what I read. The heart represents the center of a person's soul the control center of one's desires, motives, and spiritual being. God isn't in the business of replacing qualities, giftings, and perspectives unique to you. He's all about the life-saving eviction of a diseased control center and replacing it with one that can make you operate and fulfill the purposes for which he created you. That's why the gospel isn't a recipe for self-improvement. It's not a mix of working with what you've got, sprinkling in a little religious effort, adding in discipline, strategy, and a healthy dash of likability. After the 10 minutes is up, the clay mask feels hardened and I can hardly move my face. It's time to wash it all off. I then apply the Innisfree Jeju Orchid Eye Cream. I like to apply eye cream first before applying anything else on my face so that the eye area is concentrated with just the eye cream rather than toners, essences and other things that should avoid the eye area. I use my ring finger to apply the eye cream because it's supposed to be the gentlest finger, being careful not to apply too much to avoid development of milia, which are little bumps around the eye area which are very difficult to get rid of. Then I use the Pyong Kang Yul Calming Deep Moisture Toner using just my hands so that I don't need to use any cotton pads. There are very mild AHA and PHA ingredients in this toner along with centella extract and hyaluronic acid. Next, I use the Cosrx Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence. This is one of my all-time favorite products. It really helps to repair any damaged skin, moisturize, and helps with breakouts. 
For moisturizer, I use the COSRX Hyaluronic Acid Intensive Cream, which is very moisturizing. Next, I put on a sheet mask. I only do this once every few weeks, either after all of my skincare or just after washing my face. Tonight, I'm using the Innisfree My Real Squeeze Green Tea Sheet Mask. It helps to brighten and moisturize the skin. I usually leave my sheet mask on for around 20 minutes. In these 20 minutes, I enjoyed reading When Striving Cease and then switched over to reading Agatha Christie's Cards on the Table. I love reading Agatha Christie's murder mysteries. They're really fun, smart, and I love being transported to a different time. After 20 minutes has passed, I took off the sheet mask and PSA, don't throw away the sheet mask yet. There's still lots of precious serum left on the mask that I like to apply all over my neck and arms. And don't throw away the plastic packet either. I like to tip out the serum and apply it all over my legs. And lastly, because I've been having some breakouts lately, I applied the COSRX Centella Blemish Cream, which is an incredible and fast acting spot treatment cream containing Centella Asiatica. And that concludes my 10 step evening skincare routine. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe and let me know what are some of your favorite skincare products in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.